From artificial limbs to organs, advances in technology over the years means the future is looking more and more bionic. There's even bionic dogs and kangaroos out there. Today came the news that surgeons in Manchester have performed the first ever bionic eye implant in a patient. Kind of gross, but pretty impressive. Ray Flynn is now using a retinal implant which converts video images from a miniature video camera worn on his glasses. Based on advances on things like 3D printing, scientists are driving the revolution in personal electronics within the world of bionics. We've got people with bionic eyes, hands, knuckles, arms and legs all of which can be controlled by the brain. Whilst these body parts are more user-friendly than ever before, there are now functioning artificial organs available to replace ours. These include the pancreas, the lungs and the heart. Researchers have even developed prosthetic skin, which can wrap around a bionic limb. The skin can also feed back sensory information to the nervous system, meaning that users can detect and feel objects. In 2013, the world's first bionic man was created. He was dubbed Frank, short for Frankenstein. He's made up of 28 mechanical body parts and he also has a circulatory system and a beating heart. Progress in transplantation seems almost continuous and a number are already improving lives. Although it really is amazing, it does make you wonder, have we ever been so replaceable? It's clearly possible to produce a fully bionic person now and not just go on the fantasy of 70s TV programs.